Well, hey guys, I hope everyone's doing well today. Um, sorry about the YouTube guys. I posted part one before I ever posted part two and YouTube is taking all day to post that one, but it is on my TikTok. Um, anyway, the Lord has poured his spirit out on me so strong today and I feel like time is just really running short. So if you don't know Jesus, just believe in him, guys. Um, and the dream that I had last night, you know, Jess, she had the same dream. She just, I described the two dots and she saw the same thing in her dream, which was amazing. Okay, so um, I claim that Jesus Christ is God. He's the son of God also. And well, let me just say, I claim that Jesus Christ is the son of God. He's also God. He died and shed his blood on the cross for us, and he rose on the third day. And ignore the telegram and the WhatsApp people. Okay. Ephesians 2 9. Salvation is not a reward for the good things we have done, so none of us can boast about it. Job 3 14. I would rest with the world's kings and prime ministers whose great buildings now lie in ruins. 1 Peter 2 9. But you are not like that, for you are a chosen people. You are a royal priest, a holy nation, God's very own possession. As a result, you can show others the goodness of God, for he called you out of the darkness into his wonderful light. 1 Thessalonians 3, 9. How we thank God for you because of you, we have great joy as we enter God's presence. Here's the message. My child, Passover is here. Purim is here. I can't wait to redeem my people. It's coming soon. At the midnight, the stars fall. Are you watching for my hour? Is it here yet? The tide rolls in. Is it dawn to dusk? I am at the door. Trumpets will sound. I am uniting with my bride. The turn of events have come to a jolting point. Pleiades, or play, I don't know how to say that, play, Pleiades, will run into Ophicus. The dawn is breaking. Spiritual warfare will commence. Heaven's gate is open. It's time to make a choice. You are either for me or against me. You worship me or you worship Satan. There is no more middle ground. My door is closing. Your faith, it's like tossing in the wind. Whatever the direction the wind blows, you follow. You are lukewarm and I will spit you out of my mouth. Where is your heart? Where is your trust? Where is your faith? Elijah, Abraham, Ruth all had faith. It's impossible to please me without faith. <clears throat> you will perish for your lack of knowledge. When you belong to this world, you don't belong to me. You can't love this world and me. You can't worship good and evil. There's only one savior, one Messiah, and I am the great I am. I am your Adonai, I am your savior. I shed my blood on the cross for you. I died for you and rose again on the third day so you may be saved. Waves, my child, waves. Darkness, my child, darkness. The movie, have you figured it out yet? You are my prodigal sons. The return is near. Has the journey been made from the stars? The moon at her feet, when is it? Has the flowers bloomed yet? Has acid rain fell? Bellows, has my fire burned out? Darkness, has the precursor happened yet? The path through my doorway is very narrow. Many never find it. They still think they can work to get to heaven. They are blinded and misguided by past biblical teachers through men who are not praying to the Holy Spirit for truths. Not everyone should be a teacher. I have not called everyone to teach, but the ones that teach will be held to a higher standard. There are so many speaking in my name, and there are so many false prophets. There are many lies in my name. Did I give authority to speak? 
Did I put my words in their mouths? Do not trust it, children. You will know who is from me based on their fruits. You will know who is false and who is true. Are they showing you you are saved by faith and my grace? Are they showing you once saved, always saved? No angels or demons can snatch you out of my hand and won't blot your name out of my book. Are they showing you to believe and trust in me? If they are saying I have already came and I am already here, it is not from me. If they are saying you have to endure my wrath and there is no harpazo for my bride, I did not give them my words to speak. Test the spirits. The devil comes as a deceiver, an angel of light. The devil can give you visions. The devil, or I'm sorry, he can put words in your mind. I have given you signs for my coming. If you follow all the signs that I have given you, you will know redemption is nigh. Keep looking up. Missiles are coming. Ice is coming. Drones are coming. Texas, Virginia, Georgia, New Jersey, Florida, wake up. Please wake up, children. <coughs> Sorry, I'm coming. Dreams. I have given my children many dreams. There is a reason I do these things. I have given my people visions and words of knowledge. I would never give a vision to attack your neighbor. I told you to love your neighbor, not condemn them. Witchcraft and sorcery is what you follow. You are a false light. You are wicked and you seek whoever you may be, whoever you may devour. All you can think of is wickedness. <coughs> Sorry. If you don't repent and believe in me, you will perish. I know everyone's heart. Yours is wicked and black is coal. You will be accountable for every word you speak. You are not invited to the wedding feast and you will be thrown into the outer darkness of weeping and gnashing of teeth. You wish death on my anointed ones. You scoff and mock my words. I will not stand for this mockery. I love all my children and I have no favorites, but not every gift you receive is from me. So pray to me for discernment and let the Holy Spirit guide you to truth. Snow is coming. It will be over five feet in Ontario, Toronto, and Montreal. Don't doubt my prophets. My words will come to pass. Believe in me. Trust in me. I will save you. I wish for no one to perish. I am your Lord God, and I have spoken. Um... Okay, I'm going to stop there, guys, and then I will read the rest of the message in part two. Okay, so um, it's kind of a long one. <laughs> um, but trust in Jesus, you know, believe in him with all your heart, guys, and he will save you. And um, guys, you know, it is your faith and his grace that saves you. You know, he changes your heart. He changes your mind. <clears throat> you come to him with like childlike faith and he does the rest. You know, you can't, you can't do it based on good deeds. You know, your fruit's going to change based on having the spirit in you and you're convicted by it, which is why when you truly believe in Jesus and you truly asked him in your heart, he will give you spirit. He will give you conviction and your mind changes, which is why the ones who have left Jesus and stopped believing were never saved. The ones that are truly saved will have the spirit of the Holy Spirit, Jesus Christ. And they, and no angels can take him away. No, no one, he will not blot your name out of the book. Guys, he's taught me that. So, you know, truly believe in him with all your heart because he knows our hearts and he knows when we doubt stuff. Okay. All right, so this is part one and stick around for part two. And I'm sorry, YouTube sometimes just makes part one take forever. They're doing it on purpose. Have a blessed night. I love y'all.